we're looking at the first case that as a visitor you come to in the Mary Kwan exhibition here at V&A Dundee and that looks at the evolution of the miniskirt and I guess there's two myths that surround this. One of them is that Mary Kwan invented the miniskirt which isn't true, it was around before her. She was just really the first fashion designer to I guess make it popular and to sort of notice what women on the street were wearing and turn that into a global fashion item. And the other myth around it, and you can see this from the display, is that from the moment you hit 1960 you immediately get the mini skirt, you get like really short skirts and that obviously isn't the case. Um, so that the, the dresses that you see here range in date from 1962 to 1966 and it shows you that in 1962 you're still starting with something that's really quite conservative. The dress is skimming the knee, it looks quite proper and then as the decade goes on, year on year, the skirts become shorter and shorter until you get to 1966 where you see what we would know today as a mini skirt and the dress is sort of like mid thigh. One of the dresses that's really important to talk about, particularly because we're in Dundee, is this jute pinafore dress um, that dates from 1965. Mary Quant's known for her really innovative use of textiles. She loved experimenting with textiles and this is a perfect example of it. So she used jute, obviously a fabric that's very practical um, and not particularly known for its use in fashion and certainly not at that point and still quite rarely used today and she turned it into this incredibly fashionable pinafore dress worn with a roll neck that was really of its time and looks incredibly contemporary and was designed to be worn by an architect who was really fashionable.